bruh. Well, well, well. Today is an epic moment in the history of this channel because, boys, we finally made it to How Is Twitter Free? Episode 69. Okay. I want to thank my mom, my dad, my wife, my three kids, my cat called Gertrude. Uh, I want to thank the boys. I don't know why, but it feels like this is a special video. So, uh, yeah, I just want to say thank you for sticking around and supporting the series and me. And without further ado, let's get into it. <laughs> Old people coughing is terrifying. Also, uh, this was tweeted out on the 12th of January. <laughs> I think this tweet holds like a bit more meaning now. The weekend said, I don't accept apologies. You did what made you happy at the expense of my emotions. And I understand it, but I won't respect it. And that is the mood for all 2020. Uh, I never said this. <laughs> Just went swimming and I brought a bath mat instead of a towel by accident. What a freaking embarrassment. Whacked out on the side of the pool and everything. Why do buses and trains cost money? Like, you're going that way anyway. Give us a lift, G. Found out that typing, please sir, activates the <clears throat> emoji. No one talked to me. People with Android, stop commenting, it doesn't work. No one cares, lol. <laughs> I was just at Starbucks on my lunch break, and the guy in front of me in line asked the barista if they could crumble up two blueberry scones and blend them into his drink. I'm not sure what his story is, but I hope he finds peace. By the way, guys, do you say scones or scones? Sc sc scone scones. Which one? Tell me. <sighs> Where did I go wrong? Hey, do you still want to hear the song I wrote for you? Lol, um, I forgot to tell you I have a boyfriend, so stop texting me. Okay. Also, your music sucks. Hey, it's okay, man. I like your music, okay? Okay, so the University of Liverpool Library tweets out saying, This is not a bookmark. I <laughs> Who's been using this as a bookmark in a library? A slice of cheese, yes. Who did this? Reveal yourself. The Big 20. Ah. <laughs> 20 and WWE heavyweight champ. Well done, son. Bruh. <laughs> I'm not even gonna lie, I actually think that belt is just sick. Like, where can I get one of these? This must be a $10 million Gucci item. No, King. She didn't leave you on red. You left her speechless. <laughs> 100 emoji. Ah, well, this explains a lot to me. No wonder I'm getting left on red so much. I bought a fern that was simply described as <coughs> large. And I did not know what the frick I was getting myself into. Wow, just look at the size of that. Oh my, she's, he's big. Sometime this week, I'm going to do the GCSE paper that I sat seven years ago and see what grade I get. <laughs> okay, I'm sorry, but, but people are just bored on a whole nother level right now, clearly. I wonder what song you think we should reopen with. My milkshake brings all the boys to the stores. <laughs> and I'm like, it's better than yours. Damn right, it's better than yours. I could teach you, but the milkshake machine is normally out of order. Ouch. <laughs> no matter how much you hate your younger siblings, they'll never be as bad as that little piece of poop, Edmund, from The Lion, the Witch, and the Wardrobe, who betrayed his family to the White Witch for some Turkish delight. Damn, now I think about it, that really was a, a bit of a savage moment from Edmund. He was just like, yeah, hmm, screw my family. Your boy needs some Turkish delight. Why? Why, Edmund? Britney Spears claims she beat Usain Bolt's world record by running 100 meters in 5.97 seconds. Yep, and I believe her. <laughs> and then when people on Twitter saw this, they got very, very upset. Didn't believe Britney Spears could do such a thing, and it ended up with her responding like this. Britney Spears clarifies she isn't faster than Usain Bolt. Uh, oh, okay, I'd never have guessed. We teach girls to shrink themselves, to make themselves smaller. We say to girls, you can have ambition, but not too much. You should aim to be successful, but not too successful. Otherwise, you would threaten the man. <laughs> yeah, guys, can we get um, <clears throat> an F in the chat for Britney Spears, please? She deserves better than this, bro. Like, who's to say that she can't run faster than Usain, bro? But seriously, I have no idea how this happened. <laughs> How did this become a news article? How did Britney Spears just wake up one day and was like, You know what, boys? Today is the day I'm gonna run the 100 meters in record timing and beat Usain Bolt. 
of all people. Insecure boys to their girls. You should not be meeting friends. If your friends ask you to meet, you should say no. Pick your fighter. Hmm, this is clever. So you don't have to hold your phone, you just shove it in your sock. Putting your phone in your dog's mouth and uh, <laughs> watching it like that. Or this one. Um, <laughs> literally projecting a video off of what I think is a cow in the wild. Teacher made us turn our webcams on for class. And all the girls laughed when they saw my light up keyboard. <laughs> Frick this. Guy speed 20 with no license. <laughs> okay, SpongeBob. General public. Being a YouTuber or a streamer isn't a real job. General public now. <laughs> uh, boys, we got him. Is it me, or was this dude kind of fine? Uh, 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 it's evil. They need to let us outside. ASAP. <laughs> Yeah, I'm sorry, but you know there's definitely a problem when people are starting to find this dude attractive. I'll never forget when my ex made me delete my whole Instagram account because some random guy commented on a photo of us saying his trim was dead. <laughs> Seriously, bro, who tells their girlfriend to delete their Instagram page because somebody roasted them? I kind of understand though, like it must be a pretty emotional moment when your girlfriend finally puts a picture of you two up together on Instagram and then the comments are just saying, yo, your boyfriend's got a dead trim. Like, what is that haircut? Fraser asked me to send him a picture of my passport and I got all excited thinking he was booking me a holiday. Two minutes later, I received an email from Skybet thanking me for completing their verification process. Douchebag. I'm sick of this. When Boris Johnson catches me going for my fifth jog. <laughs> That's one for the UK boys. <laughs> Here's shut down by Skepta. <laughs> it's a good job with self-isolating. Just let Sophie attempt a skin fade. And that looks like I'm about to nuke America. <laughs> nice fade, bro. I went on a date with this girl and she didn't have blue butterflies on her cheeks. <sighs> Tired of getting catfished. This one goes out to all the girls on Tinder who use like Snapchat filters. Can we please stop that? What feels illegal but isn't? flushing the toilet in the middle of the night. <laughs> that probably is one of the most intense moments as a human being. 2 a.m. in the morning, it's late, it's dark, and you have just gone for a massive poop. And you have to make the unprecedented decision to flush the toilet and potentially risk waking up every single other person in the household. <sighs> it's a risk that we need to take though. Just been to the subway with the missus. She's never been before, so I suggested getting a steak and cheese sub, which she agreed to. As I'm browsing the menu, the woman behind the counter asked her what bread she wants. How's she gonna say Warburton's? <laughs> yeah, I'm not sure that's how uh, picking the bread at Subway works. <laughs> Kanye, sing these lyrics. Estelle, I don't want to. I don't think we should include this in the song. Kanye, I said sing the freaking lyrics. Estelle, Estelle, fine. I just met this 5 foot 7 guy who's just my type. <laughs> Last week, I went to Costco and bought a crate of water, got down to my car, and whilst opening my boot, a man walked up to me, looked me in the eye, and picked my crate of water, turned around, and walked off. Context. I'm a wheelchair user. <laughs> I don't know what to say about this man. Like, part of me almost finds it funny because it's, like, so absurd. Why would someone do that? Like, <laughs> What? You just go up to a person in a wheelchair and be like, Yep, I'm gonna nab your water. In Ratatouille, 2007, Remy gags at the smell of linguine soup. Rats are physically unable to gag or vomit, which means that the soup was so atrocious, it broke the laws of nature. <laughs> He's just like, ah. Uh. Also, I remember in one video a while back, I, I thought that the name of the rat was Ratatouille <laughs> instead of Remy. And I don't think I've ever been uh, as badly roasted in the comments before like that was bad i'm sorry okay me thinking about what to reply to a dry ass text hmm. 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 scientists say they can recreate living dinosaurs within the next five years and uh, this tweet was posted in june of 2015 <clears throat> can we get an update on this <laughs> yes yeah, 2020 now so it's pretty much been five years what's what's happening 
Yeah, I really don't think 2020 is going to plan. Like, apparently we're supposed to be recreating dinosaurs at this point, but no, we're all inside playing Animal Crossing for 24 hours straight. Nice. I picked the worst social media to get 100k followers on, for real. If I was on Instagram or TikTok, I'd be getting fat checks and brand deals. But I'm on Twitter, where I go viral and Facebook pages repost my tweets and get 1 billion shares, and my mom ends up seeing my tweet about c Bruh. It has arrived. Fainted. It would be an honor to be featured in How's Twitter Free 69 King. <laughs> and this guy has actually done it, boys. He's purchased Sneak King for the Xbox 360, and I can see it's in sealed condition, brand new. So this guy's definitely gone out and like bought this. It wasn't just lying around in his cupboards from like 15 years ago or something. Wow. Round of applause, legend. You'll always be remembered for being on House with a 369. Good purchase, bro. Uh, I'm just going to leave it there for this video. Hope you guys did enjoy. Wow, 69 episodes, guys. 69, big funny joke. And it's even funnier because I don't get to perform this uh, legendary act. Watch another video here. Subscribe to the channel. Have an absolutely amazing day, guys. And I'll see you all in the next one. Much love. Peace.